hey my people niyamuda here in today's tutorial i'm going to teach you how to create a special um, blur effect with your smartphone and i will do a design okay so you stick to the end and you see um, where i do this blow effect don't skip any part of the video so that you don't miss this particular thing that you'll be learning and also make sure you subscribe so without further ado let's start so we're going to be doing a quick burger design so as to get what we want so very quickly i'll go over to um photo room where i'll get my some of my some of my images so this is the image i want, I want to use crop it all right so uh, let me put it here okay okay so all right okay so this is it Let's bring this stage and put it right here. I really wanted the burger to sit on it. Okay, so just quickly remove the background and bring it back again. Alright, so we're done. Go back to Pixel Lab and import. We we'll import this mock up. Alright, so this is it. Okay, so now let's work on the background. I wanted a background that looks orange like. Okay, so I will got this is color. Go to gradient. This part of it, one will pick a dark shade of orange which is right here this other part of it we pick a light shade of orange which is right here okay so now 
that's how I got the stuff here. Alright, so, so let's add a kind of shadow to the and let's bring the shadow down. So, okay, alright. So let's just call it a special burger. Alright, so we can bring this guy here. Try to re increase it. Okay. Let's call it special border. Right, so let's get a phone for it. So I just picked the color from the other guys there. Okay. Alright, so let's get a logo. Um okay. Right here. Yeah. It should be here. Yeah. Okay. Right, so Okay, so let's bring in this shape. should be this but then let's see If this doesn't work, let's work on this. Okay, let's maintain that consistency. So put a little word there. Alright, just call blah 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 blah. Okay. So um you this no. Okay, let's do that. Okay, so the color is going to be black because the background is a light background. Sorry. To all the call 
so just put like that to order call kindly call this number all right to order kindly call this number so put it like that there and then let the font be consistent so i use a vertical the first time let me use another all right so this is it so we are almost there so now now is when we want to do i'm not too okay with this i'm not too okay with this color here now what if we take I pick a red color what if we use a red color and then we change it to white better like this all right so so now we want to put we want to do all those other uh motor call we want to add sorry we want to put in um these other guys is this so this way we're going to do the the blurring i will go over to photo right now click on the image i want to bring in this this okay let me work with this image first this one here um, go over to where you have um as in click on this with the transparent background and go to food right you see for some functions here replace arrange cut at light on adjust and the rest of it now I'm going to go to blur right you see different blur effect here so it wants to be in motion you can increase your part the right can use this and blur you get so I want to use motion blur. You can see it. Okay. Or you decide to use this one. And then you save. So it's as easy as that. You can see. on this All right click on this with the transparent background click on the object and move over to blow and then you choose the one that you want motion So let's go and get the last. And this time I will slow. Click on new. Add the image or the icon that you want to blow 
right photo room will scan it and remove the background if there is a background then it's present you with the classic this classic right here okay you see the first option with the white background second option with a black background which is this guy here and the third option with a transparent background click on the third option with a transparent background and you'll see graphics sometimes you see object or whatsoever click on it and then you see you can play around with some other effect here but this is the blur we are talking about and then you go to the one you want to use this is this is boca okay this is uh, Garcia blur this is motion blur and this is okay as a gun this square blur but I'm going I'm doing motion I'm going to increase it like this all right and then I'll save you get so it's it's very very easy so I'll just import it right now and I'll be able to use it for my design. Alright, so that is that. I would want this one to be here also. This just it, all right. It's just just it. It is quite easy, and anybody can do it. Anybody can do it, and you can do it. So I'm going to leave the So this is it. I believe you're able to catch it. So let's save it. Okay, so I think that's all. So this free PLP file will be available in the description of this video. Don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching.